Hey guys, Allison here with Sam Via backstage at Redkin Symposium 2013. And I've got to say, Sam, I think you are the king of videos and demos and really breaking oh, steps down Allison. for people to really understand techniques behind, like the strategy behind what you do. I was enthralled with your how a client can grow out her bangs gracefully mm -hmm. video because, mm -hmm. as you can tell, I'm in the process. Getting married in January, it's very awkward to grow them out. Tell us what you would recommend for somebody who has blunt bangs, trying to grow them out gracefully without those awkward in-between stages. Well, first of all, I really believe in fringes because I think a simple fringe can awaken a shape. Think about that. So really stay up on tune what's happening with fringes. Look what, what, uh, what was it, Taylor Swift. You know, when Taylor Swift did that fringe, fringes just started to pop all over the place. So fringes can really awaken a shape. Now, the issue with fringes is clients, well, I don't want a fringe because they're a pain to grow out. They really are. Especially if it's blunt, it's really heavy. You ever have a client grow out a fringe? They say, don't touch, don't touch it, don't, I'm growing it out, growing it out. But all it does is keep flopping in their face, flopping in their face. Think about it. When you have anything square, simply taking off the corner, when you take off the corner, now it becomes side sweeping. That's the easiest way to grow out a fringe. So when you're consulting on fringes, I highly recommend what you do is don't just complete the consult consultation at the sale. I want you to go even further and talk about the growing out process and how you're there to support the growing out process and talk about the method of how you encourage them to do that. And your technique there would be simply just taking off a corner, now become side sweeping. And then leave them long and tell them, now you're eligible for fringe benefits. Fringe benefits are, I'm going to manage your fringe for you. So after I've cut your fringe, you have one free fringe haircut in between your haircuts so because you don't want the client cutting them themselves. It drives the client back into the salon. How do they thank you? Maybe they give you a tip or maybe they might say, you remember that Redken shampoo, Sam, that you recommended? I think I'm going to buy that. Remember, fringes are so valuable and it can make you some money. But remember, take care of the guest in the growing out process. That's critical, Allison. Well, fringes have been fabulous for decades, centuries. I think a lot of people look really great with a fringe. Last year we saw a lot of the blunt. We've yes. seen Betty Page bangs in the past. What do you think will be big for next year in terms of the fringe? I think you're going to see fringes, but they're going to be very low side parts, side sweeping, number one. Number two, the edges are going to be very chewed. So I think texture is moving down from the top, down into the, the perimeter edges. So you'll start to see your fringes will start to be a little bit more jagged. Heavy, but a little bit more jagged. Remember last season, very heavy and blunt. This season, a little bit softer. So remember that. And by the way, when it's softer like that, it's easier to grow out. So what would you do, Sam? What I do, Allison, is when you cut those fringes now, don't go in so horizontal. Go in more vertically like this. That's how you create a little bit more of a serrated edge to it. All right, let's give a shout out to where styles can go for more information. Watch your tutorials online. What's the website? It's called samvia.com, <laughs> and I invite you to come there. It's all about education. If you don't know about Sam, I'm all about helping the hairdresser grow behind the chair. And guess what? The education on the website is free. That's right. I really believe in education, and some of it should be free. But I also want you to tell you, if you've never been to a Redken Symposium, you got to come to a Redken Symposium. It is one huge event. Check out samvia.com, and I guarantee you'll walk out with a technique that you can use behind the chair. And I'll vouch for that. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Thanks, Allison.